What's up YouTube? Mimi here coming at you from my channel and I'm here today with another book haul. The majority of these are adult coloring books that I've gotten in the last week and I just want to share them with you guys. Any that you see that you'd like a sneak peek of, please let me know down in the comments and I'll go ahead and film a sneak peek for you specifically of that book of your choice. All right, you guys, so let's go ahead and get started. Okay, so I got a few of these new books called Bliss, Your Passport to Calm, and they are really a cute size, as you can see, compared to a traditional size coloring book. They're smaller. They're, yeah, see, they're smaller. They feel really nice. This one's called Seashore. And I really like the fact that we have um, kind of some blue and white. Let's call it blue scale. We have blue and white, and this is really pretty beach, tropical, seashore scenes. Very pretty. If you want more of a sneak peek, you gotta let me know down in the comments below. Again, this is seashore. This one is Paisley. Again, we kind of have the blue scale on the opposite page. All these lovely Paisley designs. Really pretty. So that's Paisley and it has a really nice kind of rubberized cover, really smooth and nice. I really love this sort of cover. Here's the back. We have flowers. Oh, nice black background. Black and white backgrounds. Very pretty. Again, that's flowers. And then we have love, full of hearts. I love hearts any time of the year. Let's go ahead and take a look at love. Oh my gosh, look at that. So gorgeous already. I love the lockets, the hearts, the chains. That's so pretty. This one is a very romantic one. Hearts and flowers. Celtic knots. It's very sweet. So that's love. And then I have this one. It's a Keep Calm in Color, and it's called Tranquil Trees. Oh, look at this. Oh, so sweet. If you love vines and trees, flowers, you'll love this book. Oh, that is so pretty. Look at this one. I have to show my daughter that one. Oh, that's so beautiful. Gorgeous, gorgeous book. I love vines and leaves and trees and I love this movement here. The twisty movement, so, so pretty. Color J contacted me and asked if I could show this book. Looks very pretty. And I believe everything has the black background in this book. Just a sneak peek. And then we have a Dia de los Muertos book. And Dia de los Muertos is coming up here in the beginning of November. This is a beautiful celebration edition from Blue Star. Let's go ahead and do a little sneak peek. Oh, stunning. Look at that. Absolutely stunning. I love these. The women with the sugar skulls painted on their faces with the beautiful roses behind their ears. So gorgeous. So, so pretty. Wow. If you want to see more, let me know. And then also from the stack and also from Blue Star, we have a Color Your Christmas. And I have to say, my son and I have really been enjoying Color Your Halloween by Susie Joyner. I've shared some of those items and things that he's colored on Instagram. This is Color Your Christmas. It's like an activity book for family. 
kids, adults, various things here. You can make stockings, you can make ornaments, recipe cards, regular greeting cards, tags. If you want to see more, I would be willing to do a complete flip through of this book when it comes to activity books. I don't usually do sneak peeks. I usually give a full flip through. So if you want to see a full flip through of Color Your Christmas by Susie Joyner, please let me know. On to some other books. This is called Make Something Beautiful, Coloring in the Maximalist Style. Not minimalist, maximalist style. And the cover is just gorgeous. There's a really pretty pink foil on the front. Let's go ahead and look at the back. Okay, just show you just a few pages. And the thing that's really different about this book is that there are hints and patterns in different shades in this book in the background. Some of the pieces even have a little touch of that color. And I really like that. I think it's really different. Now, if you want to see more of a flip through, you know what you got to do. Again, that's make something beautiful. This one, ah, you guys, beautiful. Rachel, this is so beautiful. So, so beautiful. I do have another book on my channel by Rachel Reinert. I hope you guys will check it out. This is called Desert Wonderland, a serene coloring retreat. If you guys have been here on my channel for a while, you know I love cactus and succulents. And I just, oh, I just really am loving them right now. So let's take a little peek. But first I want to mention there's a beautiful um, kind of a copper gold or an orangey copper foil accent on the cover, which is really gorgeous. We're going to look at a couple pages here because I want to hear from you guys. I want you guys to tell me that you want me to take the time to review this book. If you love cactus too, if you love desert scenes, and if you're really into southwestern design and um, plants and things from the southwest, please let me know. Beautiful. Oh, I'm so looking forward to working in this book. Desert Wonderland. Okay, now we went from the desert to the forest, which I also really love forest books and woodland books, and this is called Woodland Creatures by Amy Ray. And I'm just loving the foil accents on all these covers. We have green and gold foil accents on this cover. Foil is where it's at, right? So let's go ahead and open this one up. Double-sided pages. Um, they don't look like they're serrated, so just have to be extra careful if you want to pull them out. This work is done with a very fine line. It looks very crisp and clean, and I really like it. So that's Woodland Creatures. That wraps it up for my adult coloring books that I've gotten this week. However, I have several kids books I'd like to show you that are brand new and they are so cute. So hang around a little bit longer and I'll share those with you as well. Now I got these for my niece. These are board books and I'm going to start reading some children's books on my channel as well. So this is one that I'll be reading. Of course, I have some favorites picked out already, but this book is really sweet. A sweet little story about the mama and the baby and all the things she does to need that next bath and how you get your bath and you're refreshed again and off you go again with more activities. So that's time for a bath and this is time for a hug. And again, the same mama and her baby, all the things they do in their day and the fact that mama's always there and we're gonna hug all the time and the mother is really loving and it just shows the interaction between her and her daughter or her and her little son. Can't really tell with the bunny here. But again, really, really sweet book. 
This one is also for my niece for when she gets a little bit older. I hope my sister isn't watching this because then the surprise will be ruined. Okay, this is called Mary Had a Little Glam and we have a glitter font on the cover here and look at Mary. Mary had a little glam. There's her little lamb, but this Mary has a little glam. And this book is just too cute. Taking the traditional nursery rhyme and switching it up a little bit. Yes, we will meet Mary and learn all about Mary's sense of style and her personality. I think it's just so cute. And of course it rhymes. Very cute. This is another one that I'll be reading here on my channel. Now these three are going to be for my son, my five-year-old. This is called The Bot That Scott Built. These children's books I'm planning on reading here on my channel. So let me know if you want to see it. Very cute. Talking about Science Day. <laughs> and all the things that happen. Okay, so that's the bot that Scott built. And this one is if a T-Rex crashes your birthday party. You guys can imagine the sort of problems that will be going on in this book. Because he's so big. <laughs> My son also really loves dinosaurs. Yes, I haven't shown him this yet, so he's going to be really happy. And last but not least, Leaping Lemmings. And this book is so adorable, this little lemming. He is just so cute. And this book is all about being a leader and not being a follower. And it's just really adorable. If all your friends jumped off of a cliff, would you? It is such a cute book, you guys. You really want to see this one very very cute so hey you guys that was my book haul that was my adult coloring book haul and children's book haul if you liked it and you want to see more book hauls you know what you got to do hit the thumbs up button share with me down in the comments below the books that you'd like to see reviews of or the children's books that you'd like me to read. I'm really looking forward to getting into this. So you guys, please share your feedback with me. Well, all right, you guys. Thank you so, so much for watching. Bye.